sister. How much did you say this? Uh, this one is sister. No, I know one dear one, no. <laughs> Hi loves, good morning. Hope you guys are doing amazing. Today is one of those days I'm particularly not happy because as you guys can hear from the background, it is rainy. It is raining heavily. It started raining this morning at 5 a.m. I was hoping that by now it must have stopped, but it doesn't look like it's going to stop anytime soon. It's like so the plan for today was to go to the market and stock up the house. Guys, my house is literally empty, my kitchen is empty. That is, it has got it to that point where even salt, ordinary salt, I don't have it in this house. So, I really plan on going to the market today to stock up the house, like do a little bit of bulk shopping for groceries, vegetables, yeah, all that basic stuff you need in the house, right? And just hear how the rain is falling outside there. And the annoying part is that I don't even have an umbrella. <laughs> I really, really plan on going to the market today, honestly, guys, because... When I have money in my pockets, I love to execute all the plans I intend to do for that day. For example, like right now I have small money <laughs> and my plan is to go to the market and shop. Now, if I don't do it today and something comes up, like anything can happen at any moment. You know what? You just should not really say, I know where oh, this one has happened, no, this one has happened, no, and you need to contribute money to get so I feel like once I have my money in my hand and I have plans for it, it's better I just go ahead and do it <laughs> at once before anything happens because like I mentioned, anything can happen at any moment. But this rain, this rain, I don't know if it's trying to speak to me. Is this rain trying to speak to me? You know, things happen for a reason. So maybe this rain is trying to tell me, maybe today's not a good day, postpone this day. <laughs> or postpone this project or whatever you have to do today or whatever plans you have to do today just postpone it but i don't understand how since 5 a.m it has been rainy and it doesn't look like going to stop anytime soon and i know we're gradually moving to the rainy season we're in april now and april may yeah so i feel like it's time for me to get an umbrella because what if i have to go to work today and the rain is falling <laughs> How am I going to get to work? So, I don't know what I'm going to do right now, but fingers crossed, this rain gets to stop. Anytime today, eh, by fire, by force, I'm going to go to the market. And I plan on going to Marche Sandaga because there it is affordable. There's no way I'm going to shop in this market where I live. The Bonamosa market. Lie, lie, I don't fit. That market is so expensive. You go with 5,000 francs or 10, even 20,000. You come back with one small thing in your back, in your shopping bag. No way. Things are very expensive right now. We have to shine our eyes. No dream for no man this year. <laughs> Even in the market. So, yeah. By the way, I don't know if I'll introduce this vlog. Welcome to today's video. It's basically going to be me shopping. Okay? I'm shopping for the house of one. For a family of one. <laughs> anyway, guys. We'll talk later. See ya. Many hours later. I just got to the market and immediately I got there. Usually you'll find some young guys ready to render service to you either by carrying your bag throughout your shopping process or just basically show you around on the various areas where you can get particular stuff. So for some reason, I decided to hire this guy in front of me. But guys, you have to be very, very careful. Some of them are thieves and some of them are honest. But this guy was really good. <laughs> Why can you not buy them? You don't have time. You don't have time. Give. This is not taking time. You don't have time. This one has a cut in now. What time they pick by the dish and cut? Mm. No, but I'll choose now. That's what I'm talking about. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 I'm going to go to the 
The problem if you have change. All of that is one three. It will be one eight. No, I don't want this one. I want the only poirot. Only poirot. Yeah. I don't eat this thing. You don't eat this one? Mm -mm. Ah, I'm eating to the tea. We'll go wash it. I see wash it. Eh? I'll go and wash it. I'll go and wash it. It's okay. I'll go and wash it. Don't worry. No, let's just go and see. Yeah, I'll take one, one bonjour. Yes. No, ça va. Il va pousser un sang. Mix it here. Now how much? Ah, uh, how much did you say? This one is six No, no one there, one no. This is more than enough. I don't want plenty, I mean. Yeah. One five. Then you want to wear now? One thousand. Hey, wait. Me from. No wonder my sister not there. Ici c'est combien Ici là. Euh, pour oui le poulet. C'est un poulet. Euh. Maman. Et on est détaillé par. I am done shopping and I paid him 1,000 francs for his services rendered and that was it. Two days later. Hi guys, so this is like days later after I went to the market and within which I went ahead and washed everything up. As you guys can see, they are looking really, really clean. So today, the plan is to, you know, cut everything and store in the refrigerator and I bought some, um zipper seal to store all my veggies okay so let me just go ahead and show you guys all the things i bought first of all we have this huckleberry here um the next day i realized that it was getting rotten already so i had to do everything everything possible to boil and store in the refrigerator so it came up to two bowls here i have my okra this one i haven't washed because i also learned over the internet that if you want your okra to stay longer, make sure you don't wash it. Let it still remain as dirty as it was <laughs> the day it was bought, right? So this one costs about one five. Look at okra for one five, guys. <laughs> at first, say okra for one five will fill this basket or this bowl. By the way, the huckleberry costs one thousand. Over here we have this paisley leaves. I also gonna head and wash this ones. I bought this for five hundred francs, as you guys can see. It's a whole three bundles for 500 and I have my washed carrots over there, 500 francs as well. Over here, I have um, ginger. I bought this for 100 francs, this whole plate. Over here, I bought, guys, this is one thing I regret in this, my shopping. Okay, this green pepper. I was trying to patronize this woman though, but look at what she gave me, rotten pepper. Just because it was raining that day, I was dirty. I did not see it clearly. But anyways, we're going to work with it, okay? So I bought this for 500 francs, all of this. And over here is snails, okay? It's just coming from the freezer because if you don't preserve it like that, it's going to get bad. 
so i bought these two snails for uh 1000 francs see how small it looks <laughs> oh god here i have a pack of um pepper 500 look at tomatoes for 500 francs guys it's not even up to 10 <laughs> so i did not buy much i'll just be buying from the quarter anytime i need tomato i'll just go and buy over here i have smoked fish it is bonga four bonga for how much was that again i think yes four four of these for 500 francs so i bought it for 1000 over here i have these leeks and I bought this for 1,300 francs. I wanted for 500, but they were not selling for 500, so I had to just buy the ones that was available. And guys, when I tell you, it is much, it is it is much. So over here, I have this um, dry spices. Yeah, it's white pepper. I bought one roll. Um, yeah, it's seasoning for fish. Okay, I also bought this one. I think this one costs 500 francs. I also have seasoning for chicken, 500. And because I love spaghetti so much, I bought seasoning for spaghetti, 500. And last but not least, I bought curry for 500 francs as well. I think it's 10 of them. And over here is my, uh, what was it called again now? Okonobong. Sorry, it's looking this way. I've not really had time to work on it, but today I'm going to work on it. I'm going to slice it and boil and preserve. So this is my zipak here. I bought this one for 1,500 francs. It comes at 20 bucks. I hope it's going to be enough for, I don't know. Anyway, I bought this one for 600 francs, this one bundle. So yeah, so today, like I said, I'm going to work on them and store them in the refrigerator. So see you guys when I am done and it's, really, it's time for me to store them in the refrigerator. Peace out. One eternity later.